the second lecture of computed properties and in this lecture we will learn how you can set computed property and for this we have this example in here in our js we have element targeted then in our data we have first name john and last name doe and our computed property joins this first name and last name and returns us full name now in our html i have this div with the id of app and in that div i have this single input which is bind to this computed property name using v model and down here i am outputting that name which i receive from computed property now in this lecture we will learn how we can set computed property right now we are only getting complete property based on our data so this complete property returns us full name from joining this first name and last name and returns it right here but now because our input field is binded to this complete property name whenever i changes this input field like this it gives me error complete property name was assigned to but it has no setter which means we set up our computed property for only getting value not for setting value if there's any changes and by default computed property are getters only so how can we set that so in here if we don't write computed property in es6 this will be like this but instead of this for setting a value we will cut it and in our property which is name i will create a get which will return us result full name from our data and after that i will use set which will receive value for setting or you can say it could be new value and for setting new value i will split that whole string and assign it to first name and last name so let's do that Okay, so as you can see in our complete property name I have get for getting value and set for setting value and set receives one argument which will be new value you want to set and in that I am just assigning new value to our data first name and last name easy so let's test it now Okay, so no error and if I change it now it is working perfectly fine as you can see so this is how you can get value from computed property and you can set value see you in next